Welcome to the unboxing of the new Unique Typhoon Q500 4K Pro Edition. Opening the box of the Typhoon Q500 4K, you'll see some information about the 4K. You also have some information and manuals, quick start guides, as well as LED cheat sheet. An accessories box that holds all your accessories. We'll go through that later. Two full sets of props and your ST10 Plus sunscreen. As you can see, the new Typhoon Q500 4K comes pre-assembled out of the package with the Seago 3 camera 4K. We'll move on over to the ST10. You can see it is new as well in the matte black format. It includes the sunshade, the smart charger, and options to charge both in your vehicle and at your house. The ST10 charger, the steady grip, two sets of rotor blades, and two batteries. Next we'll open the accessories box and see what's in there. In the accessory box you can see that it includes a micro SD card with adapter, the neck strap for your ST10, a propeller installation tool, the charge lead for your ST10, a pair of tweezers to help you upgrade your Q500 Plus, a USB interface adapter for your computer, an extra latch for your battery door, and finally, a set of keys to keep everything locked up in your case. After you remove everything out of your box, the first thing we want to do is start charging our battery so we can get in the air as fast as possible. Go ahead and take your adapter, plug it into the power supply, plug it into your wall, and then plug it into your charger. You'll immediately notice that the charger will start blinking green and is ready for a battery to be installed. Go ahead and grab your battery, use the included balance lead connector, plug it into your battery. The charger will immediately start blinking red. If it blinks green, that's okay too. That's just letting the cells balance. The next thing we're, we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our wall charger for our ST10 Plus plug in the charge lead, plug it into our power, and then plug it into the side of your ST10. Okay, we went ahead and already removed the SD card from the, the package. What we want to do here is we'll slide the micro SD card out from its adapter. We're going to flip the Q500 over, remove the cover lock, and insert the SD card. Keep in mind the SD card needs to, can only be installed one way. Once that's installed, flip it back over, and we're going to move on to propeller installation. You'll, know, you'll notice that A corresponds to the A on the propeller. Well, go ahead and put it on, and just loosely install all the propellers. After we get all the propellers loosely installed, we're going to go ahead and put on the prop installation tool and give it a few turns here until it completely stops. Repeat this step for the rest of the blades and you're ready to go. When your batteries are fully charged, you'll notice the charger will light up green, indicating a full charge. Go ahead and grab your battery and pull the connector off and it's ready to be installed inside the Q500. Slide the battery in until it's locked in place, close the door, and remove the charger from the ST10 after it's fully charged. 
Now we'll go outside for our first flight. If it's bright outside and you're having trouble seeing the screen, grab the sunshade out of your, your box, open it up, and install it on your ST10 Plus.